Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, Share and Knowledge Video Tutorial. In this video, I am going to show you how to clear ARP cache in Windows 10 or 11. Let me tell you something about ARP cache. Basically, ARP Address Resolution Protocol is a program used by a computer system to find another computer's MAC address based on its IP address. Particularly, while troubleshooting a networking issue, one might come across a many of potential problems. One such extremely unlikely likely occurrence is the presence of incorrect data within the ARP cache. This issue mainly occurs when the user has tampered with the file or created their own ARP cache for some reason. Whatever it is, the issue must be fixed. That is what we are going to do. So watch the video and subscribe to the channel. Okay. Let's see how to clear ARP cache. Here we have two solutions. Solution 1. You need to disable or stop routing and remote access from services to do that open the run dialog box by pressing windows logo key plus r in the run dialog box field type services.msc and it enter to open the services window under services window scroll down the list until you find either routing and remote access and then double click on it then you will see routing and remote access properties window here on the general tab, make sure that the startup type is set to disabled. If it's not, click on stop under services status and then click on apply and click on ok. Once done, close the services window and reboot your system. Windows will create a new ARP cache based on your connection. Solution 2. Clear the ARP cache using command prompt tool. To do that, simply open the search box by pressing windows logo key plus Q then type CMD in the search field and then under relevant search results select command prompt run as administrator. It will open command prompt window in the command prompt type net sh space interface space ip space delete space arp cache and hit enter once done this will clear out all the arp cache once done close the command prompt window and reboot your system windows will create a new arp cache based on your connection you don't have to do anything manually anymore it would be fix your network issue with arp cache that's it i hope this video helps you thanks for watching and supporting please don't forget to hit like and subscribe your contribution is more confidence to us if you have any issues so please let me know in the comment section below please don't forget to subscribe my channel for more useful videos once again thanks for watching and supporting see you in next video bye take care